He is Puddles, the sad clown, and he is making another appearance Tuesday on America's Got Talent, which, of course, is right here on 11 Alive. This character has become a sensation in the week since his appearance on the season premiere. He may be a sad clown, but he has a lot to be happy about right now. <laughs> he does. 11 Alive's Doug Richards takes a look at the gentleman behind the grease paint. Before he became somewhat of a TV sensation, Puddles was an Atlanta guy who only occasionally dabbled in clown attire. What's your name? Puddles Pity Party. On stage, he was mute until it was time to sing. Then the voice let loose. You know, when I saw that first, the time he, the first uh, performance he did, I cried. Grant Henry is a longtime friend of the sad clown whose onstage persona and costume frames the voice that Henry has heard for decades. I think he's now a national treasure. In the morning, late in the Before that, Puddles was an Atlanta fixture, performing under the name of King Sized, led by a shaved headed six and a half foot tall singer named Mike Geyer. King Sized leads a wildly popular charity driven Elvis tribute every year at Atlanta's Variety Playhouse. People like entertainment, and we bring entertainment to the stage. But the clown was never far from the surface. More than a decade ago, he led an Atlanta novelty band called Grease Paint. Grease Paint had a gothic sadness all its own, but was no pity party. But I couldn't see that the joke was on me. And it was clearly a forerunner of the singing clown that has commandeered a national audience and mural space alongside the Edgewood Avenue bar called Church a night spot Geyer has bartended and where Puddles has performed. I'm not over-exaggerating. I think he's a national treasure. The next chapter in the Puddle story will get written Tuesday when the sad clown appears again on America's Got Talent. Back to you. Big talent. Interesting story. Thanks, Doug.